Um, again, it's always good to get a victory at home. Uh, you know, anytime you play at home, your, your objective is to win uh, your home games. You want to, you get six of them guaranteed to you. Uh, if you play really well during the season, you might get a seventh uh, during the conference championship. So when you get six, boy, you need to try to win them all, and and uh, we can check uh, we can check that goal uh, off our off our list of goals, uh, winning the home opener. Um, uh, overall, you know, there were some good things. There were some not so good things. Uh, I think we got better from week one, even though I, I think there were some things that maybe we backed up on a little bit. Um, but uh, I thought we I thought we got better uh, as a football team. Uh, we we didn't play well in the second half. It spurts on defense. Really, really, it wasn't. It was just a position or two that didn't play well. Uh, wasn't the entire defense. Um, so we got to fix those things. Uh, I thought we ran the ball. Or we ran the ball effectively at times, but we hurt ourselves with penalties. Same thing, uh, uh, you know, big explosive plays hurt us. Uh, we had penalties late in the uh, in the down. So uh, we've got to, again, when you win and you have an opportunity to go back and work, that's always a good thing when you can win and have issues that you can go and fix and go coach on uh, your next practice day. That's a, that's a good thing. Um, you know, I thought Brian London played well. I thought uh, Aaron Brewer played well. Um, just noticing those two, that Keenan Brown played well. Um, he's a guy we've been trying to uh, make sure we uh, uh, target in our offense because he is a uh, a good player. He's a good player and a dynamic player. He has some things that really help us uh, in our offense. Uh, I thought Robert Brown played really well there late in the late in the fourth quarter running the football. Uh, and, and I expect him to get more touches in the future. Um, you know, we had some guys, you know, today was kind of a day for some guys to show up uh, to give us an opportunity to evaluate them. Some of them did well, some of them didn't. Um, so as we move into, you know, start to play conference games, you know, we start to, who's going to travel with us, who's not going to travel with us. We start making those decisions starting tomorrow. Um, so uh, this was a good opportunity to evaluate some guys. Questions. The second half mm-hmm. defense mm-hmm. Some things went wrong. Mm-hmm. It didn't go wrong. We just didn't execute. At a position, you were saying yeah, we just didn't execute at a position. Yeah, the Dixon, the receiver that they had, mm-hmm. it seemed like he really started to gain some ground in the second half. Yeah, we busted two coverages against him. What was, what, that's all that you think was happening with him? Did something change in their game plan with him in the second half? Or? We busted two coverages. Well, I think we emphasized running the ball in the second half. We weren't in the first half. We were we were trying to do a little bit, I think, too much offensively in the first half instead of just running the ball. And I thought we had an emphasis on that in the second half, and it showed up. We ran the ball better. Coach, were your thoughts on how Willie Jones improved from week one to week two in this game? I thought he did some good things as far as decision-making with the ball in his hand. Uh, he threw the ball away at times. He made the one silly uh, throw over there uh, on our boundary. Um, he still, you know, we still want to, you know, improve his accuracy at times. Uh, there's some things he's got to get better at. But uh, I thought he did some good things in the run game and the relief game that were better this week than last week. And it was an FCS opponent. You guys were projected to win by 35. Mm-hmm. It wasn't that big. Are you satisfied with this win? Or you, is there still a lot of things you're taking? I'm always satisfied with winning. I'm always satisfied with winning. Florida got beat by... Kentucky today. Florida State's losing to Sanford right now. I'm always satisfied with winning.